me when you can see her. My son found her in just one of the uh, the little caves or the holes right there that they had dug into this gravel pile right here. We're hoping for a rain to wash the gravel pile and we'll search it for fossils because it comes from a, a creek or a river where a bunch of um, a bunch of fossils wash out. Look at that. There's a gorgeous mother, probably a garden spider, is what we call her. It might be the funnel web spider because they look very similar. My son called it a wolf spider, but I don't think these are actually wolf spiders. And she's just covered in baby wolf spiders, sorry, in baby garden spiders. Just her whole abdomen just covered all the way over. Almost underneath too. And they're not going to be staying on here much longer. This is about the size. And that may be one of them. Did I pass over it? I saw one moving somewhere right here. Yeah, it's right there. Right. Well, oh, sorry. Right there. Anyway, I'll bring you in close with our our uh, little is it a macro lens? Whatever the uh, the magnifying lens is, I'll bring you in close so we can get a nice look at her. Hello YouTube. Well, we've got a special one for you today. This is a mommy garden spider. I don't know if it's a, a funnel web spider, American funnel web, or if it's a garden spider. My son called it a wolf spider, but I'm pretty sure this is not a wolf spider. It's just what we called garden spiders growing up. You'd see a lot of them when you cut the grass or something like that. And she has got a papoose of baby spiders all over her back. How cool is that? That's awesome. Not often you get to see them with all the babies all over the back. Good job, Mommy. Good job. So where did you see her again? I saw her, she was just kind of camouflaged, and then boop, she started moving. And then her abdomen too. She was in one of these caves right here. Where y'all had dug in the gravel right here? Yeah. That's pretty awesome. What is that red right there? Do you think that that is a mite? Or is that part, is that her tooth or something? Well, it doesn't seem to be moving, so I'm not sure. Isn't that just the neatest thing? Look at all the baby spiders just tucked on there. Those spiders are not going to be staying on there much longer. 
I don't I think they're about the size that uh, pretty soon they're going to be coming off That is a lot of baby spiders. And she's just carrying them right along, all faithfully, like a good spider mother. All right. Thanks, YouTube. Thanks for watching. Also, be sure and check it out. We have at least 10 more arachnid videos that we've uploaded. Some of those are just short clips of ones that we found out in nature when we've been on a trip. And we also have a series called the Arachnophile, so those who love arachnids. And right now it's highlighting the brown recluse. So if you like arachnids, spiders, creepy crawlies, be sure and check out those videos as well. If you have any comments, any specific ID on this spider, or any other questions or comments you'd like to add, put those down below. Be sure to like, subscribe. Thank you so much. Y'all have a great day. One says this is our bonus spider. I'll put the lens back on and we'll have a look at this one. It's a gorgeous spider. Shiny and black. Not a black widow. Can you see the eyes on it? And there it goes.